Hi, my name is Bill Hicks. Today I'm going to show you how to create a new material library using 3ds Max 2013. Once you've created a custom material that you may want to use in the future, you can easily save that material by creating a new material library. In the material editor, select material, get material, or press G on your keyboard to open the Material Map browser. To create a new material library, open the Material Map browser options and select New Material Library. This dialog will allow you to save your new material library to any location on your computer. Once you hit Save, a new Empty Material tab is available for you to use. All of the materials stored in the Material Editor can be found under the Sample Slots tab. From here, you can drag your custom materials to your new material library. The asterisk next to the material library name indicates that the library has been updated, but the changes have not been saved. If you right-click on the Libraries tab and click Close Material Library, a dialog will ask you if you want to save your changes before closing. Select Yes. Now, the next time you want to use your custom materials, open the Material Map Browser options, open Material Library, and select your Material Library. Now your custom options are available for you to use. And that is how you create a new material library in 3ds Max 2013.